After 64 matches and a month full of football action, the 18 karat pure gold FIFA World Cup trophy found a new home in France as Le Bleu silenced Croatia 4 2 at the final match played at the Lushniki Stadium in Moscow. It was a game which France took charge from the first whistle to the end, but for Hugo Lloris' 69th minute blunder that got Croatia a cheap second goal, it would have ended 4 1. An embarrassing moment of the final game was when about four pitch invaders ran into the field of play, causing a momentary stoppage by referee Nestor Pitana. French kid sensation Kylian Mbappe led the pack for individual honors at Russia 2018 World Cup. The Paris Saint-Germain forward was awarded FIFA's Young Player of the Tournament, while Croatian inspirational captain Luka Modric won the Golden Ball for the Player of the Tournament, as Belgium's Eden Hazard and France's Antoine Griezmann won the silver and bronze ball respectively. England's captain Harry Kane went home with the Golden Boot for scoring six goals, while Griezmann and Belgium's Romelu Lukaku got the silver and bronze boot respectively. Thibaut Courtois, the Belgian goalkeeper, was the winner of the Golden Gloves, while Spain emerged FIFA's fair play team. A Russian feminist protest punk rock group based in Moscow, Pussy Riot, have claimed responsibility for the pitch invasion during the World Cup final on Sunday. Stewards inside the Lushniki Stadium were caught into action in the second half of Sunday's showpiece between France and Croatia as four individuals ran onto the pitch. The four invaders were dressed in black trousers with white shirts and black ties, seemingly the uniform of Russian police officers, and emerged from behind the French goalkeeper's goal. Referee Nestor Pitana duly stopped the game while the invaders were removed. The Pussy Riot posted a message on social media claiming responsibility with a series of demands from the Russian government. French President Emmanuel Macron has congratulated Russia's President Vladimir Putin for his perfect organization of the World Cup. Macron, accompanied by wife Bridget, who watched France despite Belgium at the semi-final, met the Russian leader at the Kremlin on Sunday afternoon before the match between France and Croatia at Moscow's Lushniki Stadium. Macron told Putin, I'm here to congratulate you as the organizing country for how well this event has passed off. It has not only been watched around the world, but the whole world has come here to watch it. To do it in safe conditions and with everything going perfectly was a challenge, so well done for that. Follow Hotspots on social media. We are at HotspotsNG on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram.